My name is Yun Ni. I'm a research associate professor in the Department of Biostatistics. I was born in China. My dad was a math teacher, and I was like math, and the math came really natural to me. I grew up in China. So we probably did not have the luxury to think about, you know, what, what we really like, what's our dream back then. And uh, in high school, we have the chance to fill in uh, what kind of major we want to have. I actually chose biology. And uh, when I went to college, actually, I found I wasn't very good with lab experiments. And uh, I was pretty awkward with my hands. And, and then, um, but fortunately, I learned uh, quite a bit of uh, math, uh, even with the, the biology major. And also, I found myself really like physiology anatomy and ecology. So something about human beings, uh, human health, and something about patterns um, uh, sort of uh, uh, are very uh, interesting to me. Then I came to the United States to uh, attend a graduate school here. I eventually chose biostatistics. The major was perfect for me, and it was sort of a combination of uh, um, math and uh, computing and uh, and health sciences, as you can see. And then uh, um, then I went to work for a couple years afterwards, and then I wanted more, so I came to the University of Michigan to study PhD in the Department of Biostatistics. And uh, then after I got my PhD, I joined the faculty in the same department. So I focus on, um, currently focus on um, breast cancer research and uh, kidney disease research. We just have done this research a couple of uh, months ago, and we're looking at the, um, the renal disease database in the whole United States. There are so many you know, different tests that sort of help you navigate the decision whether you're going to um, actually get in chemotherapy. If you do get chemotherapy, the side effect is huge, whether you're going to get uh, radiation therapy, which kind of radiation, radiation therapy you're going to get. We want to look at how patients are treated and uh, whether the treatments are beneficial. And so there's so many options to make and so many choices uh, you have to you know, um, choose from and then and who can help you with this and whether one choice is better than the other. And I found that process, uh, know, knowing that is very fascinating to me. I feel like every day I'm solving a puzzle. And also I found uh, even I'm not a physician, I'm not the front and center treating patients. Um, However, my work um, that sort of helping answer the research questions, the results actually can influence many more patients, thousands, thousands of patients. Any research I do can uh, impact so many patients, and uh, that, that to me is a, a success.